What's going on guys? It's Brian with Buffalo Beer Reviews. Uh, oh, it's been a great day. The eclipse rolled through Buffalo and caused a huge commotion. Awesome. So, school is starting this week and I thought I'd throw another video out there just before I got really, really busy. Do you know what I mean? I saw this last uh, time I was up at Premier Gourmet. And it's uh, one of you know our go-to names in Buffalo and that's Southern Tier and I've got their seasonal brew Warlock um, and this is an Imperial Stout it's an ale brewed with pumpkin and pumpkin pie spice which you know I, I believe I've had it in the past but it was a long long time ago and uh, I thought I would just grab another little bomber and show it to you guys but this is an 8.6 percent alcohol by volume Imperial Stout if you guys are familiar with Southern Tier, they also do the Pumpkin, and uh, the little description on the back is, is kind of cool, plays well with that. It says, Warlock is the master of the underworld, brewed to bewitch your palate on its own and as counterpoint to our very own Pumpkin, the ruler of pumpkin beers. With its full body, notes of pumpkin pie spice, and roasted, roasted malt, Warlock is uh, black magic in a glass sounds awesome um yeah looks like it was bottled uh very recently um you know i, I had the uh the date on here and i lost it but for the sake of time let's get a cap off this and see what it looks like mm. <laughs> yeah you know i think uh you know when you're talking about pumpkin ales and stuff like that. I think you're thinking of these really golden looking kind of uh, lagers and ales and, and they don't all have to look like that. So again, this is the Southern Tier Warlock, the 2017 seasonal. So right off the bat, guys, you can see this is a, this is a stout looking beer. Um, I get very, very little light coming through and that's just at the very end. Um, Looks well carbonated, although it's hard to see. And it's got that kind of mocha looking uh, colored head to it. Real tiny bubbles, uh, looks really nice and packed. Not bad at all, not bad. Yeah, you know for uh, an imperial type nature to the beer, uh, I'm really only getting a lot of the roasted maltiness to it. I'm, I'm not getting an overwhelming uh, pumpkin presence and stuff like that. No, I, I'm I'm getting more of the that you know that fall that spicy um, sort of of flavor to it. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Smells really really good though. So let's see how this tastes. Mmm. Yes. Um, I'll tell you, um, the flavors make this uh, a very, very pleasant beer to drink. It's very, very smooth. It really is. So initially you get that very sweet sort of, it's not even a pumpkin, but it's that, it's that really dense pumpkin pie sort of pumpkin pie filling sensation. Do you know what I mean? And that's good. And it kind of sticks around and it coats your mouth. And, you know, you're drinking, a, you know, you're drinking a, a, a pumpkin filling type beer. Um, what is really cool about this, though, is... I don't think this is your typical vehicle for an Imperial Stout. Or it's not your typical vehicle to have, you know, 8.6% alcohol delivered to you. So, you know, you do get that, you get that really big wallop of uh, pumpkin. And you get this nice little um, spice note to it. And you do ever so slightly get those uh, roasted characters to like the pumpkin and to the imperial stout and the roasted malts but 
you don't really get that that bite that an 8.6% imperial stout uh, does to you ever so often. Do you know what I mean? And it's it's really nice. Um, I'd say this is, uh, I'd say three quarters of, uh, of the gauge of like a medium bodied beer on its way up to a, a full heavy uh, bodied beer. Um, it's very smooth. I just burped. I'm not getting much of an aftert aftertaste. Uh, whatever I do have it it dissipates really quickly um, yeah I I have to tell you uh, this 2017 seasonal warlock is extremely enjoyable um, I don't know if you wanna it would be a cool idea to get a, a warlock bomber and a pump King bomber and kind of you know do side by side that might actually be a, a, a pretty cool video idea um, coming up but you guys that's it for me um this beer is not going to be a hard beer to finish um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed it uh, as much as i enjoyed making it um i hope that i am allotted some free time during the semester and uh, i don't have to be a ghost and i can keep making some videos but um until the next time guys hit that like button uh, leave me a comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.